This is an installation video for the Age of Empires 1 HD Edition mod. The first thing that you're going to do is you're going to have downloaded this .zip file. Right click, extract all. I've already done that for the sake of time. Here's it extracted. I'm going to go into it. There's going to be three folders and this installation document, which has the same thing in the video, but just in text form. All right. So the first thing we have to do is we have to go to the Age of Empires 3 installation directory. I'm using Steam, so I'll go here. I'll right click the game, Properties. Then I'll go to Local Files, Browse Local Files. It'll go here, go back. This will bring you to where it is. These are the rest of my Steam games. So the first thing you're going to do is right click Age of Empires 3, hit Rename. I'm going to press the right arrow to go to the end of the file. Type in something like dash original game to let me know that this is the original Age of Empires 3. Then I'm going to go back here, go to where it says version 1. This is the game. I'm going to hit rename. I'm going to go here, rename that to Age of Empires 3. You're going to cut it, right click cut, or you can do control X, and then go back here and paste with control V or right click and paste. Make sure to cut. Copying will be really slow and you don't need two versions of this. Alright, the next thing we're going to do is where it says Age of Empires 3-2 directory. We're going to rename this Age of Empires 3. Now here we're going to go back to uh, documents because Age of Empires 3 saves the sound and maps in your documents folder. Go here. Now where it says Age of Empires 3, you're going to right click so, so you know that this is the right place. You're going to go back to here. You're going to uh, cut it again and you're going to paste into there. That will paste the maps and the sounds. One last thing, if there's ever a patch, I'll put it in this format. Version 1 patch 1, you would rename it to Age of Empires 3, and then you'd browse local files again, go back to common, Age of Empires 3, and then you'd cut this file and then paste it in here. It would ask you to replace files, and you would say yes, replace all files. So now I'm going to close this. I'm going to leave this over here. I'm going to go here, and now hit play, launch Age of Empires 3 with Asian Dynasties. Yes. Yes. Mod will launch. Mod launches. Uh, when you go online, log on to ESO and create a new home city so that you don't get European cards. And if you want to play a game, hit the include custom maps to play the new maps. Uh, this mod is multiplayer only, so don't try to play versus UI. So now if you want to go back to the original game, you'd go back to the installation directory. You can rename this something like dash AOE1 mod. And then you would rename this the original game. You would delete that and put it like that. And you could switch between these two, naming this original and then this Age of Empires 3 is what will launch. And then you'd launch it again, Age of Dynasties, play. That would launch you to the original game. I've removed the .bar files, so nothing shows up there, but that um, that would be how you would play the original game. Alright, that's it.